new table and chairs. I'm obsessed. I've seen ads for this like everywhere. <laughs> so I wanted to try it. This style, I feel like I see these almost everywhere. I mean, moving is so expensive. Like. So good, you guys. It's like it's something better than that. YouTube channel. My name is Rachel if you are new. Today is the first morning, well second morning in the apartment but it feels like the first because I have groceries and a table and things are a little bit more put together. So uh, I just went, our apartment complex has this cute little um, food truck coffee thing outside, literally right outside of our door like I could see it. So I just took Winnie on a little walk and got a vanilla latte. It's so good. Their coffee is very, very good. I need to see like what um, coffee beans they use because it was really, really good. I think it's local based in Raleigh too. So in the apartment, comp it's like on them, which is so sweet. So we did that this morning. I took Winnie on a little walk. She seems to be doing a little bit better for like the past two days. She like wasn't eating, wasn't really adjusting well. And I just think cause it's like, we don't have like a couch and like things aren't unpacked and stuff like that yet. And I feel like she just feels maybe stressed from the environment but we're slowly getting things together and yesterday i got a table and chairs i'm going to show you guys later in the vlog well i already kind of showed you a little but and she lays under it which is what she did at the beach house so i know that she <laughs> she likes that we finally have some furniture which i like too so uh, i just wanted to start off the vlog i have to sit here and edit a video that is due today for approval for brands so i'm going to get started on that it's only like nine o'clock so that's good and uh after that, we've got a bunch of stuff to do. I need to go through all of Dylan's clothes. He is a hoarder. I'll show you that later. That's what's going on. Thanks so much for watching today's video. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, all of the stuff. I just moved to Raleigh if you are new here, North Carolina. New table and chairs. I'm obsessed. I found these yesterday. Sorry, there's just clutter everywhere, you guys. This is the real life of moving. So I got these chairs and table yesterday i'm so excited the other two there's gonna be four all four are the same uh look at what <laughs> but they're on back order so i mean we have two now which is perfect dylan and i can sit and eat dinner together but we have two more coming i'm very excited uh but i wanted to show you because this is the first piece of furniture we have in here this is from world market they're having a really good sale on furniture right now so i went ahead and got this table I'll link it for you guys down below. I really, really love it. It was very easy to put together as well. And it's a very like nice, sturdy table. And then we've got, I'll show you the chair, the one that Winnie's not sitting on. We've got these. I wanted the Restoration Hardware uh, fabric chairs. You guys probably know which ones I'm talking about. I feel like everyone these days has them, but World Market has a very good dupe. I'm obsessed, they're so comfy. Even Dylan was like, wow, these are really comfortable. So super cute, literally probably like one fourth the price. And I feel like this is still very like restoration hardware vibes. So I really, really like it. I like the look of it. I like how it looks with the kitchen. I feel like this is a very nice homey area to have in the apartment. I'm really lucky that our apartment has like a little dining nook area because I really like being able to sit here and edit and like have breakfast and stuff. So I'm still editing this video. It's taking a little bit longer than I hoped for. Um, and I just made some like salami and toast and some grapes. So I also ordered uh, curtain rods, which will, I ordered four of them. So I'll do this window, this one, 
this one and then the uh, window in our bedroom. So all the same curtains and curtain rods. So I'm excited to get those hung, but I just wanted to show you guys this table. I'm obsessed. Winnie loves the chair. They roll and everything, so super cute. Oh, the rolling kind of freaks her out a little, it's okay. Uh, Dylan's back, he just took my photo for me for the first time. Did pretty good job. We took our air mattress, I mean, wait, not our <laughs> We took our mattress out of the bedroom and, let me show you guys. Our mattress out on the patio because we needed to air out. It smelled kind of strange and I think because it was like in a box and stuff, so that's airing out. Winnie's relaxing, Dylan just got home from football and we have the AT&T guy coming like any second he should be coming so we're waiting on that and then i'm going to tackle all of the clothes on the floor because um that's my goal today uh to have the dresser be coming delivering soon so uh that all needs to be like we need a donation pile a giveaway pile all of that so that's what's going on i'm wearing the cutest little silk dress from princess polly like i said dylan just took my photo and it was so funny because normally like my mom will take them um but now dylan's gonna gonna have to be my go-to guy i guess but i'll show you it's gonna be a fall haul up with princess polly it should already be up for you guys but uh, i'm wearing these little sneakers i'll link them and then this cute little silk dress from them so cute and then this little bra from free people it's so good you guys it's like just a thin little v-neck bra it's from free people i can link it i literally don't even wear a normal bra anymore so love you're keeping or not keeping these are not keeping we're gonna fill that bag and give it to your family dylan um is a hoarder of clothes so, so we're working does your family on it. want any other stuff uh no i don't think so my mom doesn't have big closet space either there uh-uh i need a few pairs i know but remember the cleats stay in your car yeah don't slam that because the grass will fall off the spikes. So this is going to your car, this little pile I made. My truck. <laughs> Dylan, you have more stuff than me. This is insane, dude. Okay, Rachel, I want you to think about this. All the stuff that's gray, black, or red was given to me. I know, but you never like went through. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start folding and putting it in this bag, the stuff that we're getting rid of. What, is there anything you want me to do, or am I good? <laughs> You're not good. You need to start putting... You need to start hanging up your clothes. <laughs> what do you mean? Are you... Look at our living room. It's not funny anymore. I'm about to cry. You're not about to cry. We don't... So stop saying that. We don't have enough space for all of this stuff. I we made don't. it work in that one little room I had. We can make it work in between two rooms. But now there's two of us. It's compromised. Yeah, we have so a all my stuff can fit into this one room. Okay. You can get to it. You do you, buddy. But these boxes need to be out of there. Like, my space is not having the boxes. I'm not holding the boxes. Okay, move them. Put them in the corner of the bedroom. I don't care. Are you just mad because I got in the master closet? I mean, I wake up first. <laughs> Why don't I get that one? Because then when you get ready, you go in there and don't wake me up. Stop itching your butt. That's gross. Okay? That is actually really logical. Remember this morning when you were leaving and I was like, good night. And I was like, wait, I mean, goodbye. Yeah, I was like, no, I'm great. <laughs> like, 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 why time. did you even keep this? I don't know. I think that was, I don't know. I think Fresh someone left it at my place. Fresh is nice. All right, you can turn the camera on. What's this? I'll just get this. <laughs> Will you open that door, please? Okay, there's something up with my camera. Come here, Dylan. See it? Oh, now it's not doing it. Never mind. Okay, we just got back from the grocery store. I wanted to do, this is literally like such a mini grocery haul, but I thought I would share. We've just slowly been getting things for the apartment. 
because we literally had nothing. I went to Publix yesterday and got some stuff, but it still feels like we have nothing. We had tacos last night, but anyways. So I have just like a few things, but we're going, we're gonna make, uh, what's the meat called that we're making? Oh, yeah, we're making brats, onions, and peppers for dinner with potatoes, so we just thought it was going to be quick and easy. Potatoes, peppers. We're going to try these out. They're these beer brats. They look pretty good, so we'll see how that goes. And then I got some fun drinks and spices. I'll show you guys. So I got just a few more spices because we have literally nothing. I got pumpkin spice. I thought this would be good to put over my coffee so I didn't have to always go to Starbucks to get the pumpkin cream cold brew. I could just make it at home. I got some garlic salt to put over our potatoes for dinner. Also garlic salt is just like one of my favorite things to cook with. Cinnamon for over fruit and all that. Got some olive oil. I wanted to try this out with my dinner tonight. I've seen ads for this like everywhere, so I wanted to try it. It's the poppy. It's a prebiotic soda, and I've been into soda recently, and it's so bad for you, so maybe this will be like a good alternative. Uh, and then I also got this cold brew. This is a local brand to Raleigh, so I've never seen this one before, but I'm excited to try it. And then also, I got, uh, I got this a few weeks ago uh, from Macy's. And so I figured I would pour the cold brew in here, make cold brew ice cubes and put them in my coffee. I thought that would be good. So that, and then I got this huge thing of cold brew. It was on sale and I figured it was just good to have in the apartment. And then I got, this is my favorite brand of oat milk and almond milk. It's so good. They were out of the oat milk one. So I just grabbed this almond milk and it's a uh, vanilla flavor. So that's what we got going on. I'm going to cook dinner and then we're just gonna hang out. It's Friday night, but we've just both had a long day. I've been doing YouTube stuff all day, basically unpacking and then Dylan's been at football and stuff. So that's what's going on. Dylan, yeah. is it done loading? He's like that. Um... You want me to cut up the leg? Alright, we're gonna try this. Yeah. Are you trying to light the Q-tip on fire and then light the candle? Yeah. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. It's not working. Yeah, that's not a good idea. We're gonna burn the house down. This, if you're a soda drinker, try this. It's 20 calories. Prebiotic soda, so good. Drinking in a wine glass on a Friday night. Woo! I just scared Winnie. Winnie, do you want some wine? <laughs> I'm gonna make those ice cubes, so in the morning. Oh wait, Dylan, should we do this one? Should we try out this one? Wrong no, one. that's the one I was saying I'm gonna open in the morning. No, I, want, I didn't buy it for wait, you to do that. this has. Okay. <laughs> Uh, it's like sticky. I'm gonna link a similar one. I think Crate and Barrel has one as well. So I'll link that one in this video, but we're going to just fill them. This won't be enough for all, so we'll do these two. La Colombe. I don't think that's how you say it. I think it's La Colombe. I'm, I'm an very idiot. interested to see how this turns out. Do you think out. we should just do four and save the other one? Yeah. Or should I do all six? I mean, I honestly have no intention of ever using ice cube <laughs> coffee. Yeah, but I do. Do you want to know it's so good? You take this and then you pour, you do a shot of espresso and you pour it over. And that right there is what I'm talking about. That's that. We're going to pour this. Isn't this flimsy? Like, how are you going to... I don't know. I haven't figured that out yet. Look at that. That's pitiful. What did you expect? <laughs> something better than that. This is nice out here. Right? In the fall. No, yeah, it is nice. And we just got 
Oh shoot, looks like someone's driving my car away. Yeah, I thought someone was. <laughs> uh, today, I, I found on Facebook Marketplace um, some outdoor patio furniture. A guy like makes it from his home, so he's making us a little set, two chairs and like a love seat. Ooh, and then I'm gonna find so like, nice. I know those, those corner, corner units. I would love sweet. that. That's gotta be so much more money. But also like think, okay, so like it's this, and then another corner, like you like can't Like we even... actually could have almost got one because we are the corner. I know, if they would have extended like this, we would have got... if these had that, we would have got them. And you want to know what would have been so nice? This would have been French doors right there instead of a window. Oh, that would have been so nice. So nice. Like Look that. at that second floor up there. Yeah, I know. I was just telling Did you ever even know that, that the lobby had that? No. I absolutely love that we have a patio because... Winnie loves to sit out here. It makes her feel like she's like outside, you know, and not just cooped up. And a big like fear of mine was when I got a dog, like having a dog in an apartment. It just kind of like made me sad a little bit, but I know she's happy because we have this whole area and I know that she likes it. We just leave like the door open and she loves it. Hi, baby. Hey, do you want to play? Do you want to play with your champagne? Look, we both have champagne. But you can't have champagne, you're not old enough. You're too young. Too young for champagne, silly. You guys, it is 70 degrees outside. I'm keeping this open. Winnie, you can go play out there. That's so fun. Hello everyone, it's the next morning. I'm gonna make a coffee. Uh, with some stuff I got. Oh, I, I did those cold beer ice cubes. Oh my gosh. Look, you guys. Literally so cool and easy. I'm gonna have a espresso drink this morning, but espresso. How do you say it? Is it espresso or espresso? Because Someone commented and was like, if she keeps saying it this way, I'm done or something. And I'm like, I don't even remember how I was saying it and I honestly don't even know. Okay, the machine is called an espresso machine, but is it an espresso drink? Is that the difference? I don't, I literally don't even know. I'm like obsessed with coffee and I don't even freaking know, so. Okay, let's see. We'll use this one. I need coasters for this table so bad, but I have them packed up and they're with Dylan's dad, so they're not here yet, but it's stressing me out on this table. Oh Uploading my first moving vlog this morning quick. I want to get it going and then I'm going to have breakfast. So a lot of errands to do today. Yesterday was consumed of getting rid of stuff mostly on Dylan's part, um, clothes, organizing clothes, all of that. And then I had a lot of YouTube stuff yesterday, so I didn't get to run any errands. So we're going to do that today. We're going to run a ton of errands, get things that we need, and hopefully find some furniture. So. Just finished editing or posting my first moving vlog. Uh, finished up my coffee, but I want to talk to you guys super quick about Care Of. I'm gonna take this out so I can show you. Um, so, I wanna thank Care Of for sponsoring today's video. You guys know by now, if you watch, like I made my own tripod. This is actually really cute. Okay, so you guys know I'm obsessed with Care Of. I've been taking these for a while now and I am obsessed with them. So easy, convenient straight to your door um i just i'm about to run out of this sleeve i have like a few days left and then yesterday i actually just got that other sleeve in the mail so so convenient easy hassle free i hate when you go to the store and you're just overwhelmed by the vitamin aisle and the supplement aisle and all of that is just very overwhelming and 
I'm, I'm the type of person that I never know, like I know my health goals and like what I want to achieve, but I never know exactly like what that means in regards to like what I need to be taking and doing. So with care of it's so easy, you go online, you take a short little quiz. I retake the quiz very often because my health goals and stuff are always changing, especially like when it comes season to season, I just like to retake it. It's such an easy, simple quiz. I just, I don't know, I like to see what they recommend me to be taking. So uh, I just retook the quiz for this month and so I got some new vitamins in. I'll put um, in the description all the ones that I'm taking. Uh, not that it matters, everyone's different, but just in case you guys are wondering. I keep the sleeves in my pantry, but I might uh, get like a little glass jar. I just moved so I don't have it yet, but I might put a little glass jar next to my coffee because my current favorite thing to do in the morning is wake up, have my water, my coffee, and then I'll go to make breakfast and take my vitamins. So I also love how they're very transparent with their research and what kind of vitamins and ingredients they're using in their vitamins and all of that because there's so many deceiving packages out there these days that you don't even know what the heck you're putting into your body and that's just like not cool to me. I'm very big on ingredients and uh, quality and all of that. If you guys want to check out Cara for yourself, I highly, highly recommend. It's one of my favorite brands that I work with and I truly do use every single day. I also have the protein powder, which I bought while I was at the beach and I have a few other things from them and I love all of their products. So I keep them all in my pantry. They're like one of my go-to brands. If you guys want to check out Care of for yourself, you can go to takecareof.com, take the little quiz for yourself. I'm telling you, I know like some people are like, take the short little quiz. It's fun and easy, blah, blah. And then it's like, you're sitting there for 20 minutes at your computer. This is literally like a five minute quiz, if not quicker. So check it out. It's also like nice to see what they re are recommending for you because sometimes you're like, oh my God, I didn't know that I was like low in iron or needed this or more like pre probiotic, all that. So you can go to takecareof.com and use my code RachelR50. I'll put it on the screen and down below for you guys. And that gets you 50% off of your first month with Care of, which is huge savings. So check it out. Again, it's takecareof.com, RachelR50, and it's 50% off of your first order. So again, thank you, Care of, for sponsoring today's video. I always enjoy working with them. So I'm going to eat some breakfast. I have uh, what I had yesterday. I don't have a toaster, so I've been having to put um, my bread in the oven, which I didn't even know worked, but it honestly works fine. So I might have some bread and maybe like an egg or some salami or something, some grapes, and then I'm gonna get ready for the day. I'm just in comfy clothes. This is like what I live for, you guys. I think I'm like a 50-year-old grandma inside of a inside of a 23-year-old's body. It's fine. Got this little little thing going. I'm obsessed with this bowl, you guys. I got it like months back at um, Home Goods, and it's like a paper mache bowl. It looks very, Restoration Hardware has one of these bowls for like literally 70 bucks, and I think I got this one for $19.99, so, so cute. I hate that like, I shop at Home Goods so much, so I can never link that stuff for you guys, but I mean, at least it gives you some like inspo or something like that, I don't know. Okay, just got this in the mail. I literally placed a Amazon order like a night, maybe like a day and a half ago. So I'm confused. Oh, it's our, um, it's our down comforter. For our bed, I ordered, let me just sit down so I can tell you guys. I ordered the Brooklinen sheets. So I kind of like invested in the sheets and I got like the bundle set. So I got uh, the duvet cover sheets, a like top sheet and four king pillowcases. And I eventually want to get the, I think it's called the Buffy just because I'm someone who likes a lot of blankets and Dylan is someone who likes like no blankets. So I read reviews about the Buffy and there's one that's like, uh, I don't even know how to describe it. It's, it like keeps you cool throughout all seasons. So I wanna eventually get that, but I've just been, I mean, moving is so expensive. Like you have to buy little things here and there that you just like don't even think about. And then like on top of furniture and all that, like I came from having no furniture at all. So Dylan and I had to like fully furnish this apartment. So it's just been like a lot. So I'm gonna wait on that down comfort cause that's just like something we don't need right now. It's like 
almost 300 bucks, which is ridiculous. But anyways, I heard that it's like one of the best out there. So I got this one on Amazon for the time being and it was literally 20, it's like $26 for a king size, which is so good. And uh, this was like one of the Amazon choice ones. So I always like look at that. I don't know if that even means anything, but I've always like looked at reviews and stuff on Amazon. And if it's like an Amazon choice one, I always like get it. So this one is like a cooling one for all seasons as well. So this will do its job until we get the Buffy. But, and then I figured I could put this one on the guest bed when I eventually do order that. So I'm just gonna keep it in the box until our sheets come. And then our bed, which I'm so sad about, our bed frame is on back order until October 12th. I like splurged way too much and got the uh, Restoration Hardware Cloud Bed. It's like one piece that I really, really wanted in the apartment and I just figured it's a bed that I can take with me everywhere. It's always going to match like no matter what the theme or like the vibe of the apartment is. So I figured I would just go ahead and splurge. So we got that coming, but not until October 12th. I guess a lot of people splurged and got the cloud bed recently. So it's on back order, but it's okay. Set this aside for now and wait till we get our sheets in the mail. So you guys, I don't know what it is, but she never sits up when she's eating. If you have a dog, do they do this? Because it's kind of cute, right? <laughs> Winnie, you want some bread? I love working with you. Okay, I just lower this i just got to the mall um there's like a huge mall in raleigh i love it if you guys live here you probably know what i'm talking about it's called south point and they have like an outside area and then they also have like the indoor malls and they have like cb2 west elm restoration all that so i'm gonna go look through some of those stores because there's a few pieces that i want to order online but i just want to make sure that i like them and look at them in stores before and maybe i could just order them at the store and have them delivered so i'm gonna go do that run into home goods i need some stuff for the bathrooms organization all of that so we're gonna go run into the mall. It's the first day of college football it started today. So I'm trying to hurry home because Dylan has it on TV. He's watching it and I wanna lay and watch it with him. We don't have a couch to lay on, but we have our mattress. So uh, relaxing Saturday. I'm just doing a few things. Gonna go do this and then we'll see what we get into. Also, it's like 75 degrees outside. It feels so nice. I'm wearing sweats. so much good stuff at home goods I'll do a little haul when I get home okay I just got literally a ton of stuff that we needed um, oh Winnie look I found your tar toys in the car toys in the car I'm gonna sit down and just show you guys all of this I feel like when I watch moving stuff I love to see this kind of stuff so I'm just gonna well, I'll show you all this stuff from Home Goods first because I can't really link this, but I got two of these for the bathrooms. Um, and then I got these baskets. I thought that they were super cute. I'm gonna do blankets in one and then the smaller one I'm gonna do Winnie's toys for the living room so they're not all over the place. Um, I got three of these bath mats. Let's see. I got two big ones and then one small one because our bathroom one of our bathrooms can have two. They're uh, by Ralph Lauren from Home Goods. I always see these. So if you go to your local Home Goods, you should be able to pick those up. They're super soft. I got this at Home Goods, very restoration hardware. I'm gonna fill it with um, some white little glass pumpkins that I saw at Crate and Barrel, but I, I didn't end up getting them because I was like, where, where am I gonna put those? And then I found this at Home Goods and I was like, that would be so cute for the coffee table for fall. So I got that some drawer organizers and then those are the rest of the mats the bath mats target i got cleaning supplies a bunch of boring stuff hangers all that and then i got three of these and then a smaller one in there for when you walk in we have a closet and there's no door on it here i'll show you guys i have a bunch of stuff on it right now this is all gonna 
go on like the coffee table and stuff, but I'm gonna put them here. I need to get one more, but I could only find four, so it's gonna go right there. Thought that would be cute when you walk in, you would see those instead of like just wired racks, which are kind of ugly. Oh, what are you doing? I have to go get it. It's like so sunny in that front room. Okay, so I went to Crate and Barrel because there were a few things that I needed for the kitchen. And then I also got, I got these at Target. Everyone I feel like has these from Target. I got the last two, there was like not many. My Nespresso pods in this big one and then, then I got this smaller one for my care of packets. Like I was showing you guys earlier, I thought that the, that would look cute on the counter. So I got that and then we've got, we got a lot of good stuff at Crate and Barrel. I'm gonna, I'll link all this stuff for you guys because I can actually link this stuff. So I have two uh, white wine glasses, so I wanted to get two red ones. These are from Crate and Barrel, like I said. I love this style. I feel like I see these also everywhere. Um, but Dylan drinks red wine, so I got two of those. And then I got two of the matching champagne glasses. I love champagne, and so I figured these would come in good use. I just got two of each right now. I'm eventually gonna get more, but I was like, I don't need to spend money on sets of four or six of them when I, when it's literally just me and Dylan here, so. Okay, and then for the bathroom, mine and Dylan's bathroom, I wanted something on the counter that was really simple and sleek, so I got three of these, all different sizes. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> I got three of these, this is the medium, and then I got a bigger one and then a smaller one. And I'm gonna do like Q-tips, my hair ties, cotton balls, things like that in them. And I think that that's all that I'm gonna set out on the counter. I want it to be very simple and then just everything else be in the drawers. I'm gonna go to the container store one day this week and do, um, maybe I could do like an organiz organization vlog. Let me know if you guys would like that, of like my closet and my bathroom. I really want that to be very organized. So I'm gonna go to the container store for that. But I got some coasters. These are from Crate and Barrel as well. Uh, honestly, pretty affordable. They are 14 bucks, I think, and or maybe 19 for all four. And these will look really cute on our table or our coffee table. Um, I don't wanna ruin the wood. So I obviously needed some of those and then Finally, I found some of these berry containers. These are always sold out online and there was two of them in the store So I picked them up uh, Strawberries raspberries blueberries basically any fruit Fruit will stay better longer because it's like aerated in here and they're just like cute to set in your fridge So that is everything that I got from crate and barrel I'm excited to put all this up and start kind of organizing. We really needed some like bins and stuff we obviously don't have our furniture yet, which is stressing me out. I went to go look at Restoration Hardware to pick a coffee table because I still haven't ordered one and they were renovating it so it was closed. So I didn't even get to look. So I'm just gonna have to go online tonight and like do all that. So we'll see how that goes. Hopefully I can like make up my mind online. So it's just so much money to be spending on something I haven't even seen in person, so. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go put all this up, see what we end up doing next. Sitting here, <gasps> Winnie. I'm sitting here ordering some furniture. I just got a rug. I'm gonna get a rug pad. I'm gonna get it off of Amazon, I think. <laughs> I don't know what I'm telling you guys, but I'm having a coffee. It's like seven o'clock at night. I'm a psycho. I'm having a cold brew with those cold brew ice cubes that I made. That I showed you guys, and they're so good. Ten out of ten. So good, right? So so good. She's acting like she's drinking a cold brew right now. <laughs> Why are you so crazy? <gasps> I got it. I said, go get it. Yeah? Okay, hang on. Come on.
Should I make a hot or cold coffee? Definitely hot. I mean, it's not that cold out, but I was just like in the fall mood, you know? Hot. Are you ready? Like, my call would be like, we're ready. Wait, are we all riding together? I mean, we can. Hot coffee it is. Did you just say yes to take a quiz? No, she went to go get a coffee at Starbucks. Get this. I'm excited for furniture out here. Me too, I can't wait to get it. We get to pick it up on Tuesday. Maybe maybe your dad could help us um, figure out like what color to stain it and what to do to treat the wood. Cause it's, it's lit, like we have to do that on our own. It's literally just wood. All right. Like yeah, he's just we'll making it. tarp and lay it down right here. So we Right, put that on the list of things you're gonna bring. And you should bring up the power drill in case we don't want to teach you to change the Okay. You must sit up here for a second. What? You're not bringing that chair out there. Babe, these chairs are white. Bring your little folding chair. <laughs> what? Is, it, is my folding chair in here? You know what? I'm gonna go grab my cooler. Say good morning. Good morning. I just <laughs> bring me over. You're gonna grab your what? My cooler. Oh. Okay, good morning, everyone. Sunday. Sunday. Okay, we're going to grab breakfast with Dylan's friend Wit and his girlfriend Alex, and we're gonna go to the farmer's market. I'm hoping that the farmer's market uh -huh. is like kind of open, so. Uh -huh. Oh, you just scared the crap out of her. Like the your extra closet. I say we keep this blanket. Did you like it? Yeah. Yeah, I liked it too. Okay, so that can be thrown. This is trash. We just got home from breakfast. I got some new flowers from the farmer's market. They have the best. This whole thing was like 15 bucks and normally flowers are so expensive. So I need to find another vase though because these ones are these, these, not these ones. <laughs> Thanks, uh, English teacher, I appreciate it. You're scaring her. <laughs> what is he doing? Let me know if you see any more that are sticking up. Okay, I will. These from Costco are still doing very well, so I think We'll maybe move them into like the bedroom or something and then these can go in the kitchen. But I need to go get another vase because we only have one, so I wasn't thinking. Who successfully hung both lamps without having to go almost to the ER because you don't know how to hammer and got had to get stitches? Who? I've never had to get stitches from hanging a lamp. <laughs> I mean, like almost. Like you were like, oh my god, should I go? Like my fingers. Split. No, that was from cutting off the zip tie. Okay, well that's even more embarrassing. Would you like one of these? Sit. Good. Here you go. Here you go. She likes the ice cubes at my parents' house better because they were like squares, and these are. This isn't her ideal shape. Sorry, we we can't afford that nice more refrigerator. Coffee. I'm just putting ice in my old one. You're about to be wired. I'm about to take Winnie on a walk when you go to football. Oh, yeah. I might go now because I don't know how to do a lot of reading on my knee because it does not feel good. <laughs> See you all another week, another dollar. Almost football season. See ya. <laughs> that was one of your better endings. Oh my god, why didn't you tell me this what it looked like? <laughs>